Hello people out in YouTube land. In my latest release of the Push for Bitwig extension, which is coming with the Driven by Moss extension, um, I changed a little bit the navigation because that was requested by a lot of people. They demanded that we have a specific up button to go out of track groups and out of devices. Additionally to the long press of the button below the track info. I made a little project here with uh, an instrument which contains a layer instrument with a polysynth and the other one is the contact so if you go in there we can go in deeper and deeper and then you see you have always the up button and you can go out of these hierarchy very quickly and another thing that solves that or I solve there is that I made a rearrangement in the upper part as well so you have now in the middle you see something which is called banks so you can toggle with that the bank view where you see your banks of parameters and the instrument view. This solves another issue because for multi-out VST instruments it was not possible to navigate through the banks. And the same occurs with the instrument layers instrument. So if you also had more than eight parameters there, you could not navigate that. So if you are now in such an instrument, for example, like a contact from native instruments, you can now toggle between the few of the instruments and the banks. And there is a little bit of a further rearrangement here. So now the expanded state and the parameter state uh, is now put to the left of the few. For push one, it's basically the same, but the button is not up here. It's here in a second row. There is one difference that the up button is not available in the track view, only in devices, because with push one, there is still the concept that you have your mood buttons and your solo buttons there. And I didn't want to change that. So a little bit of a compromise, but I think it helps a little bit. So see you and make some funky music.